We know that 2020 is hitting everyone hard, but the city of Wuhan really had a tough year. After we controlled Corona months ago, people are once again praying for the city, and this time because of the flood. As we've mentioned previously, China has entered into the so-called flood season, and the water level of Yangtze River is constantly rising. In Wuhan, reaching 28.67 meters, this is 1.37 meters above the warning level. But unfortunately, Wuhan is only just one of the cities that faces the threat of severe floods. The water level of China's largest freshwater lake, the Poyanghu Lake, had reached the height of 22.53 meters, surpassed the record made in 1998. So people are really worried because the life of hundreds of thousands of people living around or near the lake is at risk, and their crops and livestock are badly affected. The total economic loss is estimated to billions. You may be astonished by the huge gap in the image, and that was exactly where the lake water rushed into the field and put the residents' life in danger. To repair that, it requires tons and tons of rods and sandbags. It's like a huge surgery, isn't it? Yes, really, and it's a hard one, since every meter fixed needs forty completely loaded excavators. The rescuers spend four days and nights to complete the work, and many of them are from the army. And they say that it's their honor to save lives on the sea. We have an old saying in Chinese, "Bing lai jiang dang, shui lai tu yan," literally meaning, "When the enemy come, we dispatch generals, and when the water flows comes, we use earth to stop it." In other words, there is always a solution to the problem, and we can always find it. 